The Oregon men's basketball team opens the new season Friday in South Korea, and when they do, two players will be home in Eugene ineligible. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. And I'm Renee McCullough. The suspensions were announced late this afternoon. KEZI 9 News sports anchor Eric Elkin joins us now to show us just what the pair admitted to today. Matt and Renee, the Duck basketball team took off for South Korea the early this morning for Friday's opener against Georgetown. Not on that trip are starting point guard Dominic Artis and forward Ben Carter. Both Artis and Carter Carter are ineligible for a violation of NCAA rules. According to the University of Oregon, artists and Carter sold team-issued apparel over the past year. As a result, both are ineligible for an undetermined number of games, but they have already applied for reinstatement. Artists issued an apology in a statement saying, quote, I want to apologize to my teammates for selling team apparel. I regret my actions and do not want to want this situation to define me or my character, unquote. Carter added in a statement that he's, quote, grateful to the NCAA and the university for the opportunity to make amends, unquote. The violations were discovered through an internal monitoring system and self-reported, so potentially that could help them out in their case in terms of getting back sooner rather than later. But again, we don't know the number of specific games that both these players will miss. What we do know is they are not on the trip to South Korea. They won't be playing Friday against Georgetown. And if it's 10 to 15 games, say they would be back in time for the Pac-12. Yeah, that would be enough time to get back in time for the Pac-12. Uh, I think Oregon's hoping it'll obviously be a little bit less than that.